It's my life and I can do whatever I want with it. So the question is, how do you know what to do when not told what to do? Hi everyone, my name is Bettina. I'm half French, half Colombian. I now live in Phnom Penh as a country manager for Lidapreneur. And this is the story of how I found my purpose using the Life Path tool. This story starts about nine months ago when I was living in Amsterdam, my favorite city in the world, but doing a job I really didn't like. I felt just really confused and really lost as to what I wanted to do with my life and I felt like I had lost that connection with myself I had lost that sense of purpose and I needed to get back on the right track that was right for Bettina so the first thing I realized is that I didn't need help in terms of self-help that would help me gain confidence or gain belief in myself I needed guidance I needed someone or something to give me a framework that could allow me to really figure out what it is that I wanted to do so as an analogy I'm a dive master by training, which means that I didn't need someone to teach me how to dive, I needed someone to take me on my next adventure. In the middle of all this confusion and lostness, I realized that I wasn't the only one, but it was something that was quite common to the people around me and to the people of our generation. I think we all strive for clarity and purpose, but we just don't really know where to find it or how to find it. Which is why at this point I realized I had two options. One was to wait for life to happen and hope that everything will turn out fine. Or two, was to actively take steps into shaping my life. Pfft, screen of life, but. But this was very hard to do because in that moment of crisis, everything sucked and I had all these feelings of frustration, confusion, lostness, nervousness. So actually the very first thing I had to do was to realize that I was in crisis. <laughs> embrace all those feelings <laughs> and really sit down with myself and figure out what was the best way that I could go ahead with it which meant that I had to take the time I had to take the space to figure this out and this is what I realized this was my comfort zone and outside of my comfort zone was a layer of fear and limitations that I had created myself that refrained me from going beyond them and past that layer there was this universe of opportunities so how did I know which one was the right one for me how could I know I had no idea don't know. I felt this was all very ironic because I have this breadth of education, this breadth of experiences, so I should know, but I didn't know at all. Instead, I felt very confused and more lost than ever. Don't know. And I couldn't help but wonder why was it that myself and people my age were so confused and looking for clarity and looking for answers. And it hit me that in the past we used to be so much more dictated by religion, by society and parental pressure. So how do you know where to look when someone doesn't tell you where to go? Where do you go and look for answers? Where to look? So the answer I believed was to find a tool or a framework that would allow me to discover myself, understand the world around me and understand what it was I wanted to do to make the world a better place. So we can talk later about the details of what it means to make the world a better place but ultimately I think we can all agree that if we leave this world with more love than there was when we came into it that's already a good thing so what happened at the end of my self-discovery journey is that I, don't, I identified that I was really passionate about working with young people and working in leadership and development which made me realize that I wanted to work towards empowering young people finding their path and finding their purpose Hashtag Leopard Lifestyle! One of the tools that allowed me to do this is called the Life Path Tool. And it's a tool that allows you to bring everything together in a framework that makes sense and that can allow you to identify what is it you want to create and how to get there. And it basically has three key elements. One, discover what you want to create. Two, develop your path to success. And three, drive yourself towards achieving it. What I liked about the Life Path is that it allowed me to gain a lot of clarity. It only took me a day to design it and really have that sense of clarity in terms of what I could actively do step by step to reach my goal and my vision. Here is a quick overview of the process and the way in which you can gain clarity. The first one is by looking at the patterns in your life. The second one is to discover Discover your vision free of constraints. The third one is analyzing your present reality. And finally, create your awesome future to find your purpose. Because ultimately, purpose is power and that's what's going to drive you forward. So if you too are tired of waiting, join us at the Lidapurna Academy to design your life path and take on this amazing journey with us.